A Senate panel on Wednesday will hold a hearing on the U.S. Capitol Police in the aftermath of last year's U.S. Capitol insurrection. U.S. Capitol Police Chief Thomas Manger and other witnesses are expected to appear at the Senate Committee on Rules and Administration hearing, which comes on the eve of the one-year anniversary of the attack on January 6, 2021. Manger replaced Hex Chief Stephen Sund, who resigned on January 7th. In addition to the Senate hearing, Attorney General Merrick Garland is expected to give a speech Wednesday about the Justice Department's efforts to investigate and prosecute those responsible for the attack. The Washington Post was the first to report about Garland's speech. About 140 officers were injured in the Capitol attack, and four died by suicide in the weeks that followed. More than 700 people have been arrested and charged for their roles in the insurrection. Teachers in Chicago, the nation's third-largest school district, voted late Tuesday to switch to remote learning, and city leaders reacted by canceling classes Wednesday for most of the district's 330,000 students. The Chicago Teachers Union voted to pause in-person learning and work remotely until January 18, or until COVID-19 cases fall below a particular threshold. The union, which has roughly 25,000 members, is also demanding the district require negative tests from students and staff before returning to school. Chicago Mayor Lori Lightfoot said the vote constituted an illegal work action, and Chicago Public Schools CEO Pedro Martinez described it as a walkout. Teachers who do not show up will not be paid, Lightfoot said.